Gil Cargill's Long Walk Home by Robert Conover for Saints and Scholars. How many miles do you figure that is from Macon to Middleville? A long, long walk, wouldn't you say? But I remember Gil Cargill saying it as clear as my old studs pick up rear view mirror. If I ever whiff four times in a single damn game, I will walk home to Middleville in my uniform. Well, it happened. As sure as flipping a two-sided St. Michael's medal, I was there when it did that Saturday afternoon. I followed him all the way in my pickup, and he wouldn't take my offer for a ride. He would not hear of it. But what a walk it was along the dusty way. Clarence Goodfellow greeted Gill as he was mowing the lawn with his town's last manual mower. Clarence told him he was at the game when Gill hit two four baggers and a single in the same inning. Will Robeson saw him and recalled the game Gill knocked in nine runs by hitting for the cycle on a bum knee. And in the home stretch, Virginia Hall told Gill her dad took her to the night game when Cargill took a grand slam away from Gus Sternlow with a great leaping catch before Sternlow ever made the Yankees. Talk about going out in style. I marveled, and Gil just laughed in my face. Who said anything about this being my farewell tour? I didn't hear anybody say that, did you? Get in the pickup, I told Gil. I'll buy you and me a couple of knee-high grape sodas, and I'll drive you back to Macon in country comfort.